I don't think there's anything around here. I don't remember oh, there being... Oh, there is. Oh. So, you just never look down into the lava flows. You know? No, because, like, not exactly used to that sort of thing. To be totally Do you have a honest. way to get up, though? No, no, not that I don't know. We'll one. find out. So, where is this thing that you saw? We Right here. Oh, okay. Oh, that came up from out of the... I suppose you wouldn't call it muck. Because it's not quite a muck. Excuse me. Now. Ow. Okay. There's supposedly hit markers in this game. Oh, I thought I killed this guy. I have more demonic artifacts. We should probably go art, uh, upgrade a thing. Yeah, it, I suppose demonic artifacts are more prevalent in fiery areas. Whereas the angels tend to be found next to, well, dead angels. Nothing. Nothing behind the waterfall this mm, time. Tasty. Drink it. Ew. Now the way back up. Sucks. There's also a whole area on the other side of, um... Oh. Uh, let's go back to Vulgrim for a moment. Let's go back to Vulgrim for a moment. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see. One, because I want to go spend everything. Well, make, make sure that you find what you need for enhancements. Yeah. Because you had spent all your souls on leveling up last time, and then you realized that you needed to buy some of the components. Oh. Uh, I'm probably just going to buy th two... I'm going to buy two of the, the adamantite. Would you ask of Technically, the he time? does have unfocused rage, which is kind of okay. But I like, I don't know. I don't know if I care as much. And what's the rejuvenation core? Does that just increase your HP? That just increases how much uh, our healing item heals, which is not immediately or amazingly helpful. Wait, you can just buy six relics for 2,000 souls? Yep, up to six, and then he, he runs out. Oh, right. Oh. I was going to feed him souls. Do make sure. What would you... This will be... There we go. Lose nothing. All right, so we want to go back this direction. Uh, let's see. But yeah, I'm just going to keep buying those adamantite, because we've got at least two more elements mm -hmm. to pick up, and I'm going to want to upgrade all of them. It'll be interesting to see where they are, however, because the only thing that's truly new... Oh, wait. Yeah, we never did Yeah, there's that, that whole bridge. bridge over there. Oh, yeah. So we'll, we'll attempt to figure out a way to get past it, but yeah, fighting this guy is paramount. He's good practice. Because I... I don't want to be rusty immediately diving into a new and potentially really hard zone. And considering, ah, oh, it's the I forgot again. about that again. All right. Okay, this, ah, uh, but this looks like one of the ones where you have to get both sides. Look up, look up. Uh, there's on the opposite side. There's another door that's blue. Has a blue I see light. Wind. I think that's actually a shortcut. Back. See those guys walking around there. But there's also souls. They look pretty tough. They look new. Yeah, they they're they're a new type of enemy, meaning we can't go there yet. Hmm. That is not somewhere we can go. Alright, well I'm just gonna run ahead. I don't think there's anything else left in this area. So we're just gonna go beeline for the next Vulgrim hole. Mm -hmm. And then uh Maybe level up once. Upgrade my weapon, and then uh, then actually make some progress here. Yeah. So the question is, do you want to probably go down to the church? Yeah, we're going. We're going into the cathedral. Yeah, we'll go into the underbelly of the church, and then we'll respond to Pride summons. She just seemed to open a rift in in reality that led elsewhere. She mentioned something called like the Ares, but it's. A I R E S, not A R E S, like the God Ares. And she said that when we felt worthy enough, and then you may face me. 
that kind of thing. Yeah, well, once once we've killed all the other... Oh, we had to kill every sins. other one? Yeah. When she's the only sin left, left standing, then we can go fight pride. Okay. Which, like, that's such a pride thing to say. Mm-hmm. I kind of want her to be complete garbage, because that would be really funny. <laughs> now, wasn't that also the case in Full Metal Alchemist? Wasn't pride the most powerful leader? Or... I suppose that's spoilers. You will. Uh, kind of? How did Wrath factor into everything? Because I never... He never really did anything. I forgot which one he was. He was the kid. Oh. Greetings. That's all it's I remember. It's been such a long time since I've read or seen the series. Yeah, I wouldn't mind going back and watching probably Brotherhood. Because that's one be I haven't seen. Yeah, it's a shame though, because I really liked the original voice wish. for Alphonse. Please take your time. Oh, Gnarled Cliff. Because they'd actually gotten a boy for that. But then in the second series, they have a girl voicing Alphonse. Oh, that's unfortunate. Like, he is young, but he's not. Uh, eh, well, the problem eh. is, he got to be a teenager and then he Yeah, remakes. that would do it. So. What can you do? Mm -hmm. Stop them from aging. Castrations. <laughs> I, that was the first thing. I know. That if you were going to say it, then I was. I know. Uh, but well, Matt's I, I mean, now I do know that in ancient times there were boys. That would, that would go through with that if they wanted to perpetually be a soprano in a boys' choir? Or have you ever heard of, like, the eunuch or, like, male sopranos? Right. Yeah. You know? Let's see what that can do so what's... Oh. Yeah, they were often also oh. emissaries to other lands and... Oh, hello. Huh? Chance to spawn a health lurcher with this weapon. Is that on kill? There's also item drop chance. Okay, so... This is really good. Because... Mm. I'm probably going to make it go down the demon route. Oh. Oh, I want to see the quotes. Ugh, oh, there's so many. There's treasure everywhere. If you look close enough. Or... I feel a little better with every kill. What? What are these? Looks like our luck's taking a turn for the better. I'm n it's not stealing if they're dead, right? I've wait, wait. Plundered so, a fortune. I ain't stopping now. So this is really is just the voice of the angelic marauder, or yeah. the, or the yep. demonic. Cutting marauder. up these demons keeps me fresh. The blood of our enemies feeds our hunger. And then, uh, when I seize the spoils of war, I feel more alive than ever. Huh. Okay. I, I think I'm gonna go down this one, maybe, because item drop chance. You want the demon path. Oh, but you don't get any of the... That nerfs the chance to spawn a health literature. But mm -hmm. I don't... I barely have any angel. Health has been an issue for you. Yeah, but we don't have any angel... Um. You don't have any angel artifacts anymore. Yeah, whereas Not unless I, you buy them. I have demon artifacts. Because otherwise we've got like the unfocused one, which just is like a 15% damage one, bonus. Which one do you know you want to apply demon artifacts to? I don't know how much I care. Unfocused shade. I mean, this one's kind of decent. They're all kind of okay. Arcane damage with this weapon. So this would make it really good at counterattacks. The main problem is just I don't know if we'll have enough. Do you have to choose one or the, the other? Initially, yes, and then you get down to the last, which balances it out again. So technically, you can get it there. It's just I have limited amounts of angel relics because they're super uncommon. But look, your angelic leviathan was... Huh. Yeah, so this one, I need... That's angel, yeah. definitely. Oh. Hmm? That's interesting. You I need, need demonic artifacts to actually make it balance. 
Well, right, because you're balancing out all of the angel artifacts, so you need 12 demonic artifacts to get that oh, last Oh, that's interesting. Hit, see? Pricey. I'll think about it, and one way or another. That's some blessings to you, Fury. Okay. So, we still have some stuff we can do, but let's let's go progress for a while. Well, let's go down into the cathedral. Let's see where it leads. Oh, what's the achievement? 25 to life. We probably just hit level 25. Please take your no. time. I don't know. Okay, so we want to go to South End. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as far as we know, we're not going to be traipsing into a boss battle anytime soon with a Probably not, sin. no. We've got a whole area to get through before then. Let's see. So how far behind in the game are you? How many sins have been defeated? Two. It, it, Sloth and... We've killed Sloth and Avarice. And we faced Wrath, but then yeah. skadoodled. And then there's also Envy, who I'm maintaining probably ain't dead. Really? You mean she's just so. going to burst out of the talisman and go, Wah. It could be any number of things. This could all be a ploy from Envy. She mm. was she was said to be the weakest, though. They could have really just used her as a tutorial. True. And, you know, that would be nicely straightforward, but... Oh, boy. It's actually pretty fortuitous that you encountered her first because it gave you the talisman to capture their spirits. Okay. I hate archers. I really wish you could, uh... You could, if you like, had a ranged... Or, like, a ranged counterattack or something? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I... I, I still hold to oh. the... Oh. Mm. Yeah, that's the guy that has the arm armband. And they really can fling their swords like boomerangs. Yep. I really want to counterattack these guys, but it just... Whoa. Uh, yeah. Like I said, I really hate the skeletons because they have hyper armor mm -hmm. and block. And, like, they're the only enemy that I've oh, seen that can block. that one's charred on the inside. You might... Do you think you'll be able to face it? It seems to be perpetually blocking. Does it have a health bar? Uh, yeah. Oh. It paused. Awkward moment. It, oh, oh, I knew that was going to happen. And it did happen. kill me. Okay. You probably should have gone into Havoc mode against I, it. I actually, that's what I was doing. That's why I was just standing there. I was trying to go into Havoc mode, but it wasn't taking. There's there's something about the responsiveness with either the dodges or... It's either dodges or or how enemy hits. No, it's definitely dodges. I. This was a common complaint I saw in hmm. like the user reviews. People said that you can charge the Storm Spear? Yeah. Okay. Huh. Have you attempted that? Yeah. I showed you it yesterday. I don't do it very often because charge attacks are not exactly... Ah, oh, there's so many archers. Charge attacks aren't exactly... There we go. It would be nice if you could... If you could catch them in mid-flight and fling them back. That'd be just... Okay, maybe the charge though. attack is a little bit more useful. Especially because you're imparting shock onto all nearby foes. Oh, right. You're no match for me! Looking hyper on that's making short work of them, or at least distracting them. Yeah, it's mostly a suitable distraction. Uh, okay. Here's my stuff back. There's the dude. Yep. And a little 
bone ad. And notice how he locks like that. Mm. Ouch. It. Well. Okay. Maybe he's gonna slash there. Watch out. I definitely perfect dodged that one. It's bullshit. <laughs> These guys are so not. Ouch. So. This is why I don't bother with the uh, charge attack, because it opens me up for a, a long hit. F or mm -hmm. It opens me up because it's got, you charge up, and then you hit the enemy, and it doesn't even do that much extra damage. At the same time, would your whip have been much better? I... She's supposed to throw it. She most definitely does not throw it. She... Unless there's another... There's probably another combo, but the basic charge attack... Is not. Okay. So in air, hold and release to strike. Hurricane Spear. Triple triple Tempest. Hold Y timed release. Hold Y release to strike. I I'd hmm. be nice if I could actually see like what does this even look like? Unless it's the Because there's the Notice how it goes bing? Bing. Yeah, I was trying to figure out if there's something for that one. I don't know. There's also... Oh, that's yeah. kind of handy. Fun. Like a thunderbolt. Ouch. Yeah. You can't air dodge in this game, which, like, ain't that big of a deal. That's annoying. I don't know. Because <laughs> that's the one where she throws. Fun. Which, like, actually kind of works against... Nope. I think you're gonna like the hammer or the swords. Maybe? It the hammer really... might be too slow. It so depends. it really depends on how the hammer works. Uh, so I I might like it, I might hate it. The main problem with the hammer hammers is if they Yeah, because I just remember seeing those in the promo images. Can you lock onto the enemy? Thank you. Uh, he has the high ground. He has the high ground and freaking... So, the problem is, uh... I, I keep saying hyper armor. In games like this, usually when you hit the enemy, they, they might shrug back or whatever. They don't shrug at all in this game, or they shrug really inconsistently. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's really frustrating, because, like, special, specifically with stuff like charge hits and whatever, you want to be able to... If you do that charge hit, they should shrug back or, or recoil or something. And if they don't, it usually doesn't make the Let's charge hit around. worthwhile. Uh, and so the reason why I'm, like, leery about the hammer... I know. I know. The reason why I'm leery about the hammer is because if it doesn't... Uh, if it doesn't stagger enemies properly, then it's effectively just going to be slow. Might do more damage than the other weapons. And mainly just open me up for a ton of damage. And so far, it does kind of feel like this game is going to make the hammer real bad. Did you get your souls? Uh, yeah. I got them all. Okay. So it looks like that's gated off, so we'll have to go the long way. Yeah, obviously. More eggs! Oh no. Mistress, you seem distracted. We horsemen are defined by a great many things. Our mission, our gifts, and our solitude. For so long, I cannot even remember. Rampage was my only companion. Mistress, I... Forget it. The horseman is not defined by the horse. 
Look at all this stuff. Admittedly, I don't think there's much to be grabbed in this immediate area. I like how they're trying to add more sentimentality now with well, Rampage's demise. It's not like they can make uh, war or death seem particularly sympathetic what? or sensitive. Well, but I, I definitely felt like they were. Kind of? They were more exasperated at times, though. I don't know if this is the right way we want to go. Let's go back, because there are those wind currents that I can... Mm -hmm. There is still a lot of stuff within the cave. But it would be nice to see where it leads. Yeah. That is interesting. An interesting quote, though. The whole the horseman isn't defined by the horse. But that's the very nature of the name. Oh. I totally missed this. Mm -hmm. Really? I was really hoping that would just explode all the eggs. Okay, so we have an... Okay, Adamantine. Yeah. And then this. But We've probably actually been on the opposite side of this. Purple power. Yeah, it's... Isn't it... Wouldn't it be interesting if everything just wove together and interconnected well, and you're like... Argh. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. That, that is... That's how this game works. And it's actually... It's really compelling how they laid out the maps. Like... Map making for games like this must be insane. Yeah, the level design for this game is pretty good, actually. The only grump is it gets real maze-like. What's so down if you're... below? Is that just a algae-ridden swamp or Kinda toxic looks like waste it. or what? Whatever it is, it doesn't look like you can touch that. Yeah, no, way. it does not look like I should ever, ever. even consider going down there. Mm -mm. Okay. So there was the crawl hole. Yeah. And but then there's, there was there's the these wind winds. path. Was there something on the pillar to the right? No, okay. No. That's just where you jump to. Oh. You wanted to go there first? Oh, wait, no, this just brings us back down. Mm. What am I doing? I was thinking I could get, like, up? I'm not actually sure if this is gonna... Oh, no, this... Oh, this... that... Yeah, go to the right. Hammer angle. Demonic artifact, and then this will allow you to walk around, hopefully. And there is something dangling from the ceiling. Oh, yeah. Yeah, keep an eye out for those, because I am... I'm not... very good at looking up. Well, they undulate in color, too. Sort of the dim and bright. No, they're absolutely easier to see. You're right about that. Well, it's not that they're easy to see. It's that sometimes you might pass them when they're dark. Oh. If you know what I mean. True. So it's good to, I suppose, wait. So there is that one other upper area, but I don't know how to get there. You could just waft yourself over from that ledge, probably. Oh. It looks like it's oh. far enough down. Or you can jump up there. That's an option. There it is. There we go. Okay, yeah. Go down there. Oop. So you want me to go down here? Yeah, and take a look. Did you uh, look across? Oh, yeah. no. Yeah, we've been, I suppose all, you don't want we've to go been all these places. Okay. Okay, and this drops us off at the crawl space. Okay, great. Right, sprinting button. Is this the crawl space? Yeah. Crawl ish. Oh, okay. It's... You only crawl for a bit. Mm -hmm. Look up ahead, mistress. What <gasps> is that? Stop running. Probably something new to kill. Yeah. What an astute observation. But yeah, that is. Hello, new thing to kill? A man's. Oh, they're adorable. In what realm is this considered adorable? It Perhaps seems that's an overstatement, but it is innocent. Nothing in this world is innocent. Oh, it sounds nice. So you're supposed to use them as a jump pad or as a mount? Uh, 
Um, can you lure it over to that ledge? Like here? I might have to hit it. Here, mushroom thing. Come here. I might have to hit it. Or can you hurt it? It's reaching out with a tendril. Can you take it? Or... I think I'm gonna have to hit it. Oh. Oh, the poor thing. Well, I suppose we got to the right spot with only one hit. It seems largely unfazed. Mm, mm hmm. Okay, I don't see anything else in this room. So it was called a mansk? Apparently so. Matt? Yeah, mansk. At least your adorable monster served a purpose. Harsh, even for you, mistress. A lot of eggs all over the place. Yeah, sloth minions are still at work, it seems. I mean, eh, I was gonna say it could be one of those where they're implying that, uh, Local wildlife mutated what, what into the, this. What was, what was the demon? Uh, bug spider queen lady. Oh, her? I, I forget her name. Yeah, I forget her name. Oh, it was probably like Arachne or something. Yeah, whatever her name was. I wonder if they're almost implying that, uh, Sloth was like her. Well, so, in order to help Samael in the first game, there were the four something or others. Yeah. Demon generals or something? I don't believe they were affiliated with the Sins. No, but, you know, maybe. I don't know. But we get the. Who knows? Maybe the hammer is good. Now, here's the question. Is the... Is the hammer also the thing that lets us walk up those, like, gemstone pathways? What do you think? Hmm? What are you thinking about? Being as you're... Oh, I was glancing over at chat. Oh. For a moment. But no, I am thinking about the generals and the sins and such, and just how the sins really fit into the whole cosmic balance of things. They feel kind of random. They seem so disparate. They, they're all these different creatures that resemble, I mean, well, we had an insect. At the we same time, a human. welcome We've to the bone lands. In, bone um, lands. in Darksiders 1, we, in Darksiders 1, we pretty much got the angel and demon side of things. Truly. And what now they're... Ask of this Darksiders merchant. 2 had us introduced to the makers. And some amount so, of backstory, especially for the Nephilim. The Yggdrasil tree. Yeah. And the and the Well of Souls. This will be fun for yeah. both of us. But, like, that doesn't As immediately have any relevancy to the... <laughs> the apocalypse, and who knows, it could just this be a MacGuffin. This trek would be much easier on horseback. Ooh, too soon. Again, you're here to watch, not to speak. Oh, I'm here for much more than that. Is dying on your agenda? A threat. I haven't decided yet. Oh. So, what's up with those banners? Angels. Oh! Wait a minute, this guy looks like the scholar. Yeah, he does. But more skeletal and horrifying looking. Because originally the scholar's belly would open up. It is actually the same model, they just put all of those blue pustules on him. Do you see that? Yeah, I, I think it's a little bit more. Mm -hmm. Well, right, they, but they, the pustules look like skulls. Okay. 
And obviously there's more skeletal components Ow. to his leg. Yeah, see? It's the tongue thing again coming out of the stomach. It's the same guy. Yeah, I mean, you're right. It's absolutely the same guy or design. I'm just not entirely sure if it's the same model because they changed a lot. Well, I, I think it's it's the same model. It had similar animations, but they reskinned it. Like, added on to the model. And while it might not be the scholar himself, it could be another... It didn't even look like an angel anymore. I think they were trying to make it look like... Well, actually, wait a minute. Were these You're former angels that were turned into these undead angels? Ooh, I'm not, not sure. Those tornadoes are absurdly good, actually. Mm -hmm. Ah, dang. I want to keep them around. Yeah. Now, ooh, there's little flames everywhere. There we go. Yeah, we've also got a lot of these guys. They walk like the skeletons, but they have more flesh on them and they have these, once again, sort of glowing pustules. Oh, yep, and they explode upon death. Of course they do. And they're sending these explosive mushrooms and spores at you, too. Ew, gross. Yeah, like I was saying earlier with the... Okay, there's... Nope, these are all ranged. Watch out, the mushroom. <sighs> yep. They threw a lot of mushrooms. There's mushroom. Okay, you're just outside of its range. Yep. It's almost like a little organic grenade, those mushrooms. I, One other problem that I run into with this game, the lock-on puts the enemy directly behind you. Mm. Like, if you notice, I can't see my enemies that well. It depends on if you're nearing a wall or another structure yeah. in the area, too. Probably want to get the lobber. No. You want to get the little guys. Because the lobbers I can directly avoid. There we go. Okay. But now, yeah, it, the lock-on will, like, kind of zoom in kind of on her butt, if you notice. Mm -hmm. And, it's like, the enemy will be out directly on the other side of me. Why don't you scritch your nose? I it My nose is going to be endlessly itchy. There's not much I can do about it. I just noticed that you're doing that hurriedly in mid-combat. I mean... Uh, stay back, stay back. Don't go, don't go close to it. What are you he's doing? He's summoning. Oh. You think that's the case? He's a... Uh, that's why there are more and more creatures coming out? Yeah. Okay. Well, now you've stopped the, the stream of mushroom men. I you serious? I I really I really want some things to work the right way. Are uh, you gonna go get that soul? Yes, I can go get it. Uh, but yeah, stun locks the lock on more or less zooming in on her butt instead of uh, the enemy. Because like in Souls games, for example, the lock on will kind of take this sort of angle. Where you can see them fairly well, unless they're, like, really, really big. Mm -hmm. Instead, I'm fighting a bunch of the, these small little oh. zippy enemies that hug her. Uh, and it makes it almost impossible for me to, um... There's a lot of purple material around here. See up there and around there.